Hello gamers, it is Larson here, and today I want to make a quick video saying that RSS Me is fixed. It's this app that I worked on that lets you get RSS updates on your Wii, RSS feeds. So I just, this one works now. I don't know why it printed twice, but um, I just tried with Nintendo Soup, which is a I usually use Nintendo Life, but Nintendo Soup is a Nintendo news source, of course. Anyway, that's about it. So I just wanted to, it was because of a stupid programming error. Basically, I was trying to concatenate this thing to the mail data and accidentally wrote a semicolon, which messed it all up. And I'm not sure I was not able to catch that, but a while back, Oski, he's someone that works on WeLink, made this really nice envelope icon. So thanks to him for that. He really wanted me to add it, and I guess when I did add it, I broke it. I did move it to our new server, not the reconnect one. But I want to say something. Even with a Wii house, I'm just trying to cut back on things and focus on life because, you know, I worked on this stuff for many years and I'm not getting bored of it, but it's like, there's just people that haven't really liked me so much and I kind of want them to forget about me and I, I don't do myself many favors by making videos because then they'll remember me. If I just, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to like, you know, consider this a, that I'm, Cutting back from most of the Wii community in general, not just reconnect or Wii Link. Cause you know, it's sad. The week the Wii community had a lot of creative people, but there's a lot of people who are very unforgiving and will have their own problems. Like me, I have my own problems. I can be rude to people sometimes, and I'm sorry because I've hurt people in the past. But um they, um, they're unforgiving and they, or they're just children and I don't think it has to do with who I am, but I just was always the target of being bullied or ratted out just because I did things impulsively and didn't really think before I did. But... That's why I haven't been getting much pleasure out of doing Wii stuff anymore, and I wanted to leave anyway. But I'm still here for the, all the wisdom that I have. Like, like with Wii Link, I know that there's things that they, um, that they are working on, and they're experiencing some problems that are, or some issues that I did experience myself while working on the project. So I, I just have a line, and I'm just like, hey. X, Y, and Z. I know why X, Y, and Z doesn't work. This is why it doesn't work. For example, I'm kind of getting off topic here. I'm just, it's just a mini um, therapy session. Come on, Weir Mop. Yeah, a little thing with the news channel. I'll just segue into my next thing. By the way, yeah, I... I just, all this time, I've just been focusing on thinking of where I went wrong, and I'm still working on myself to be a better version of myself. I know it doesn't sound li like much, but I mean it. Um, yeah, um, basically, they moved the news channel to a new server, as far as my understanding is. They're planning to do that. But um, it's only grabbing locations that were downloaded by the channel. Like, not downloaded by the channel. Not down, I mean not downloaded by the script because like it's, it wasn't grabbing locations for um, cities that it required Google Maps API to get the location info for. And I know why, it's because it was the, they had to whitelist our IP address for the Reconnect24 server. So it could only be used on there. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Guess what I was trying to say is 
that you should, how do I say this? We should be grateful of all the things that people do in the Wii community and that we shouldn't, um, you should separate the artist from the art because it's not very good to be avoiding one thing or something because of something I did. I know that I've done things that are wrong and I know that, that I was accused of doing things that are just over exaggerated or or downright wrong, like incorrect information because every time someone tried to call us out, they got at least one thing wrong. But I know it's a tough world. You're gonna get canceled no matter what, if you did something wrong. Just look at what's going on with Dan Schneider. They made a whole documentary about him and I'm not gonna get a documentary made of myself, but, um. He, um, he filed a lawsuit against the producers because they made that old documentary and it kind of painted a picture of a figure that he didn't want to really be identified as. But yeah, I've been much happier just by focusing on the things that I do like in life more than just working on Wii stuff. But I just, it's just with RSS me and stuff like that. I just, I'm the one who made it. It has no relation to Recon 24. It was just an alt just an additional service we offered. I'm trying to see if we can get the um, server that we use for a few Wii Connect 24 things like City Folk DLC under my control. But like everything that relates to retagging the main channels is no longer in my control. I'm just the one who's saying, hey, this is broken. You should fix it. I know why it's broken. Like I said, I haven't heard about the City Folk Deluxe thing, but that's kind of why I want to manage it because I know the code works and I think they want to release some DLC with it that they're working on with the game to people who had it. Hopefully, the problem with me saying that. I should have said nothing. <laughs> um, anyway. <laughs> I have no idea what's the progress of that mod. Anyway, hope you understand what I'm saying. There's a lot of good in the community, but I just only seem to remember the bad things. It's weird. We're so negative and pessimistic in life, but there's a skill, you know, it's a choice to be happy. All right. Well, thanks for listening to my little talk, unless you fast forward to the end of the video. It was kind of a crappy day, but yeah, just keep that in mind. Bye.